सदाशिव सरंभा शंकराचार्य मध्यमा अस्मदाचार्य पर्यता वंदे गुरुपरंपरा सुखम नित्यम स्वप्रकाशम व्यापक नाम अधिष्ठान बुद्ध्यबोध्यम बुद्धेदृग्यु निर्मल अपारम सर्वेदेद्यम प्रत्यपर मह तदेवाह न मोन्यदी मे निश्चिता मति विचार सागर फिफ्थ चैप्टर पेज 150 टॉपिक 254 लास्ट थ्री लाइन्स फस्ट पाराग्राफ असंगवादक्रियवाच शुद्ध ब्रह्मण सकाशात् जगदुत्पत्क न संगते किंतु माया विशिष्ट शबल ब्रह्मण सकाशात् जगदुत्पद्यते मायो मायेश्वर स्वरूपं प्रतिपाद्यते निश्चलदास आंसरिंग टू दि मध्यम अधिकारी हुईज सारी मंद अधिकारी हुईज अदृष्टि अदृष्टि इज वन हु ईज नाट एबल टू एक्सेप्ट दैट देर ईज नो क्रियशन सो मंद अधिकारी इज वन हु ईज नाट एक्सेप्टिंग आर एसिमुलेटिंग द फैक्ट ऑफ दैट उपनिषद्स what is that fact there is no creation really the creation is only an aberration it is only an appearance like uh, swapna prapancha then the question comes why upanishads that is brahma sutra vyasa acharya talk about the srishti and uh, shankara acharya also write bhashyam on that सृष्टि प्रक्रिया उपनिषत् इज आलो टाकिंग इफ इट इज नाट देर वै उपनिषत् इज टाकिंग उपनिषत् इज टाकिंग इन क्रम सृष्टि अक्रम सृष्टि व्युत्क्रम सृष्टि उपनिषत् इज टाकिंग द क्वेश्चन इज ईज देर ए कन्सिस्टेंसी विथ रिगार्ड टू द क्रिएशन इन द स्टेटमेंट्स ऑफ उपनिषत् so nischala dasa said there is no any order in the creation it is not required because there is no tatparyam in the creation why there is no tatparyam because it is going to be negated anyhow therefore there is ne- no necessity of uh, krama order which one comes first which one come later that is not is very important like rajju sarpa rope snake the order which head appears first or tail appears first or both appears at a time there is no tatparya in that because there is no rope snake at all why to talk about the creation of the rope snake its order krama and that like that here also even though there is no tatparyam upanishad is talking vyasa acharya shankara acharya said that they are given that means srishti principles are given in upanishads akasha vayu agni etc for the sake of manda adhikaris 
for two purposes because one purpose is uh, the panda adhikari should not lose interest in veda therefore srishti is introduced for their sake this is the first purpose <clears throat> second purpose is the srishti prakriya if we give ishvara we have to introduce maya we have to introduce then uh, to worship ishvara we have to introduce karma yoga and to meditate upon ishvara we have to introduce uh, ishvara then he can come to gnana yoga later again the guru talks about the same thing tattvamasi so manda adhikari needs ishvara's support triangular format ishvara support means triangular for, format i am dasah bhagwan is swami so he will protect me from my bad prarabdha like that triangular format student is called junior student or manda adhikari those who cannot uh, negate ishvara those who cannot uh, negate world but they take the world as real ishvara as real what to do therefore upanishad has to come down to the level of those manda adhikaris that is why upanishad the jigjog way it talks about one place it is says um, agni apah prithvi one place it says akasha dvayu one place it says uh, uh, asrjata immediately it comes like that all those things are just for name sake it is given you are not uh, supposed to probe too much into the creation because um, brahman it cannot be the cause of this creation asangatvat akriyatvach brahman is um, uh, unconnected asangaha akriyaha he cannot do any action of creating this universe who shuddha brahma from shuddha brahma shuddha brahmana sakashat panchami from that pure shuddham brahma pure existence jagat utpattyadikam jagat the world utpatti creation adipadat sthiti laya etc na sangachyate it is not possible at all already nischal das said my vichara sagara text is only for uttam adhikaris but uh, this grantha name is called vichara sagara since i am writing elaborately i can take that topic of ishvara and srishti prakriya also for manda adhikaris sik kintu maya visishta shabala brahmana even though this creation cannot emerge out from brahman pure brahman it can emerges out as it were from saguna brahma maya vishishta shabala brahmana that means uh, saguna or uh, sopadhika brahman from that brahman it can come sakashat jagat utpadyate world can born it is possible for them junior students not for senior students senior students is one who accept this whole world is projected by my avidya this whole world is projected by my avidya this is very clear for senior student no doubt but how many senior students are there very very rare manda adhikari says this whole creation is created by ishvara for manda adhikari that uh, difference is there always between junior and senior so this uh, second benefit what we said for laya chintanam talking about the creation is for laya chintanam so that the student can dissolve at the time of nididhyasanam laya chintanam means uh, pravilapanam 
so that he can uh, resolve gross into subtle, subtle into subtler, subtler into subtlest, subtlest into causal. That is, Prithvi into earth into water, water into fire, fire into air, air into akasha, akasha into atma, like that. Sthula srishti into sukshma srishti, sukshma srishti into karana srishti, like that. He can do that nididhyasanam, therefore he will be benefited. So jiva, jagat, ishvara, all are introduced. Sagunam Brahma called Ishvara. Maya Sahitam Brahma is called Ishvara introduced. For the purpose of Nididhyasanam also, for the purpose of Prarochanartham also, to create interest in the students, junior students, those who see the Dvaita Prapancha real for them. It is required. It is required. Now, we are going to enter up to here we saw in the previous class. Now from 20, 255 to 272, another topic um, Nishala is going to enter. That is uh, Shruti uh, Ukta uh, Uktot Patti um, Krama Nirupanam Shrutyukta Utpatti Krama Nirupanam What Shruti says that is going to be uh, talked about which is uh, not uh, um, Paramarthikam but Vyavaharikam Nirupanam means uh, establishing the order of creation according to Srishti for the sake of Manda Adhikaris, we have to remember to 290 to 292, Laya Krama comes there. Now, this now Utpatti Krama. After 290 only, Laya Krama comes. You see up to how many um, topics it is going on for Manda Adhikaris sake. <laughs> Once Mandhadikari comes, we have to introduce Ishwara, Ishwara comes, Srishti comes. Once you have to talk about Srishti, we have to introduce Ishwara. Once you talk about Ishwara, we have to introduce Maya. Once you introduce Maya, what is the nature of Maya? You have to know. That is going to come here. Shrutyuktotpatti kramani rupanam Prasangan Maya Swarupa Pratipadanam Maya Swarupam Here Prasangat Maya Swarupa Prasangat means what an aside topic. <laughs> Nishchala Dasa says this is not my main topic actually. Drishti Srishti Vada Anirvach, Anirvachani Khyati is my teaching for Uttama Adhikaris. But Prasangat, there are some Mandadhikaris may sit in my classes listening to Vichara Sagara. But Prasangat, as a, um, as, a aside, as an aside topic, Maya Swarupam, the nature of Maya Pratipadhanam, talking about the presentation, Pratipadhanam means presentation of not establishing. Pratipadana means you should not take establishing. But the presentation, the topic of Maya is introduced here. This topic we have not studied uh, in any previous uh, Prakarana Grandhas. This is very unique to Vichara Sagara, Prakarana Grandha. Maya Swarupam, the nature of Maya which is most uh, difficult uh, topic to understand, okay, Maya. That is why it is called Prasangat. Maya, nature is this. Maya Swarupam Jeeveshwaradi Vibhaga Shunya Shuddha Chaitanya Shrita Maya Iyam utpatti rahitatva dhanadihi tasyaha utpatti angi kare 
पुत्र पुत्र पितृ पितुत्पत्ति कथम पितृत्पत्ति कथम न माया कार्या प्रपंचात् मयोत्पत्ति कथनमसंगत भवे तस्मा चैतन्यान्मायापत्ति वक्त तथा सती जीव 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 जीवर जीवत्वो माया कार्य न जीवचैतन्यात्वाईश्वरचैतन्योत्पत्तिर्भव जीवेश्वर सिद्ध तत्सोत्पत्ति माया असिद्ध जीवेश्वर सिद्धिन्य अन्ोन्याश्रय प्रसंगा शुद्धचैतन्यं तो असंगम अक्रियम अविकारी चस्मात्मापत्ति अंगीकार शुद्धचैतन्यं विकारी भवे किंच यदि शुद्धचैतन्यात्मापत्तिच्य तरी मोक्षदशाया शुद्धचैतन्य सत्वात्पत्तिनर्मापत्ति प्रसंग सोक्षसाधन वैर्ध्यम चस्मात्मापत्तिरिता अतः ये चना सा चान शांता च इफ यू वॉन्ट टू फॉलसीफाई द होल यूनिवर्स लेट अस अंडरस्टैंड द माया नेचर क्लियरली माया स्वरूप टू एक्सेप्ट जगत आल्सो टेम्पररीली अंटिल यू एसिमुलेट एज ए जूनियर स्टूडेंट माया इज रिक्वायर्ड to negate the world also maya uh, reality the knowledge of maya is required therefore either way maya swarupam we have to understand maya swarupam the nature of maya what is the nature of maya jeeva ikhas jeeva ishwara vibhaga shunya shuddha chaitanyad शुद्ध चैतन्य आश्रिता माया माया इज रेस्टिंग आश्रिता मीन्स रेस्टिंग वेर माया इज रेस्टिंग वेर अपॉन वाट न जीव ईश्वरादि विभाग शून्य इट इज रेस्टिंग अपॉन द शुद्ध चैतन्य प्योर कॉन्शियसनेस व्हिच प्योर कॉन्शियसनेस इज फ्री फ्रॉम जीव ईश्वर आदि पदार्थ जगत आलो सो टू फिफ्टी फाइव टापिक इज माया स्वरूप शुद्ध ब्रह्मन इज दैट फ्रॉम हू इन हूम देर इज नो जीव देर इज नो ईश्वर देर इज नो जगत दैट इज वै जीव ईश्वर जगत आदि पदार्थ विभाग दिस डिविजन शून्य एब्सेंट शुद्ध चैतन्यम प्योर कॉन्शियसनेस आश्रिता सपो डिपेंडेंटली माया इज एक्जिस्टिंग माया शुद्ध चैतन्य आश्रिता ओके हु इज शुद्ध चैतन्यम शुद्ध चैतन्यम इन होम देर इज नो जीव एंड जगत ईश्वर डिविजन इज नॉट देर विभाग इज नॉट देर दिस इज इंट्रडक्षन इं उत्पत्तिरिता मीन्स माया स्त्रीलिंग माया दट्स वै इं दिस्या 
Utpatti Rahitatvat. It is not born. Maya is not born. When Maya is born, you should not ask. Maya is never born. That's why it is Anadihi, beginningless. It is there from beginningless time. Maya is there from beginningless time. That is the meaning of Anadihi. Why? It is not born. Therefore, it is Anadihi. Now, four uh, descriptions are giving. He is giving four possibilities and all the four possibilities is negating. What are the four possibilities? Tasyaha utpatti angikare. Tasyaha means maya yaha. Of that maya, if you accept, if you accept uh, jagad utpatti, uh, sir, maya utpatti angikare. If maya is born, if you say, what will happen? Hmm? Putrat pitur utpatti hi. Um, Utpatti ka uh, kathana kathanasya eva kathana uh, sprinting is not clear kathana it is like telling that father is born from the son suppose Maya uh, is born um, if you say from where it is born if you have to say putrat from the son pituhu utpatti hi father is born hypothetical argument hmm? born it is like that what uh, maya karyat prapanchat from prapancha maya is karyam is prapancham maya is the karanam prapancha is the karyam suppose uh, maya karyat prapanchat maya utpatti hi kadham uh, ka Kathanam asangatam bhavet. So from the jagat, maya is born from this world. If you say, first world is born from maya. World is the product, karyam. Maya is the karanam. Therefore, first option is ruled out. Can you say world is the cause for maya? Or maya is born from the world. It is like saying father is born from the son. How father can born from the son? Son can born, son means uh, not S-U-N son, S-O-N son. Son can born, putraha can born from the father, parents, not father born from the son. Like that from the world maya cannot born. From maya alone world can born if you say Angi kare maya karyat prapanchat mayotpatti hi kadham asangatam bhavet kathanam asangatam bhavet kathanam telling telling that it is asangatam improper illogical this is one point so what is that na maya came from the world four options this giving one is Maya came from the world, suppose anybody hypothetically says that, that we are going to refute. Uh, then Maya came from Jiva, suppose you say, that is also going to be negated. Or Maya came from Ishwara, that also can be negated. Then Maya born from Brahman, that also can be negated. So, all these four are negated here. Now, the first one is, from the world, Maya cannot born. It is beginningless. It is birthless. How can you say it is born? Therefore, ruled out. Tasmat, second one. Second option. Tasmat Chaitanyat Maya Utpattihi Vattavya. Suppose you say, from Chaitanyam, Maya is born, Tathasati, <laughs> from that also it is wrong only. Jiva Ishwara Ishwaratvayoho, Maya Karyatvad, Jiva and Ishwara both are Maya Karyam. Asmat Chaitanyat Mayotpattihi 
vaktavya you have to say from chaitanyam only maya is born suppose from world it cannot born that is ruled out suppose you want to say from chaitanyam it is born tathasati jeeva ishwaratvayoh maya karyatvat because jeeva and ishwara both are because of maya karyam maya alone is the cause for jeeva and ishwara also na jeeva na jeeva chet ಜೀವ ಚೇತನಾತ್ ನ ಈಶ್ವರ ಚೇತನಾತ್ ಮಾಯೋತ್ಪತ್ತಿರ್ಭವೇತ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಈಸ್ ಡಿವೈಡೆಡ್ ಇನ್ ಟು ಪ್ರೆಸೆಂಟೆಡ್ ಇನ್ ಟು ತ್ರೀ ವೇಸ್ ಚೇತನ ತತ್ವ ದೇರ್ ಆರ್ ತ್ರೀ ನಿರ್ಗುಣ ಚೇತನ ತತ್ವ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮನ್ ಸಗುಣ ಚೇತನ ತತ್ವ ಈಶ್ವರ ಸಗುಣ ಚೇತನ ತತ್ವ ಜೀವ so three chetana tattvams we can present in three angles nirguna chetana tattvam okay attributeless brahman is also chetana and saguna ishvara is also chetana endukane maya sahitam brahma only ishvara so saguna ishvara also chetana or saguna chetana tattvam is ishvara and saguna jeeva tattvam chetana tattvam is also jeeva at individual level so both three of them um, none of them are going to be the cause of uh, maya maya cannot born from them of these three which is the chetana tattvam is responsible for the birth of maya which chetana tattvam is the cause for the birth of maya Hmm? let us see jeeva ishvara division happened because of maya therefore uh, jeev ishvara who is saguna chetana tattvam ishvara is also cannot be the cause of maya or uh, because of jeeva ishvara um, mutual dependence anyonya ashraya problem will come anyonya ashraya dosha what is that anyonya ashraya dosha jeeva ishvara or the cause for um, maya maya is the cause for jeeveshwara if you say it is a mutual dependence anyonya ashraya that is the second problem tadha sati jeeveshwaratvayoh maya karyatvat both are born out of maya only how they can be the cause of maya na jeeve na jeeva chaitanyat na ishvara chaitanyat jeeva chaitanyam also cannot be the cause of uh, maya birth ishvara chaitanyam also cannot be the cause of uh, maya's birth chaitanya mayayoho utpattir bhavet it cannot because jeeveshwara Siddh, siddhau to talk about jeeva and ishvara tat sakashat mayotpatti maya asiddhau so tat sakashat means jeeva chaitanyat ishvara chaitanyat suppose maya utpatti you say maya asiddhau maya is not there jeeva and uh, ishvara cannot uh, create uh, maya jeeveshwara siddhi iti anyonya ashraya prasanga so maya produce jeeveshwara jeeveshwara produce maya you cannot say karanam karyam like saying gold create uh, ornament ornament create gold na can you say like that it is not correct from, from maya only jeeveshwara are coming therefore from jeeva chaitanyam also maya cannot born from ishvara chaitanyam also maya cannot born so ruled out can you say shuddha chaitanyam one more option is the nirguna chaitanyam no 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 saguna uh, chaitanyam ishvara saguna chaitanyam jeeva from that it cannot come anyonya ashraya dosha i can accept let us take from nirguna chaitanyam shuddha chaitanyam 
Suppose Maya is born, if you want to say like that, hypothetical argument. Suddha Chaitanyam tu, whereas Suddha Chaitanyam, this is fourth argument. So, you can stake tasyaha onwards bhavet, first argument refuted. That is, world, from world maya cannot born, that is. Then second one, tasmat chaitanya mayotpattihi vaktavya. From chaitanyam, if you want to say tadhasati, that is also not possible. Jiva chaitanyam, Ishwara chaitanyam, both are there. Hmm? Um, then what will happen? From Jiva Chaitanyam it cannot bond. Number one. Number two. From Ishwara Chaitanyam also it cannot bond. Number three. Then uh, fourth one is from Shuddha Chaitanyam if you want to say Maya is born. Shuddha Chaitanyam to Asangam Akriyam. It is uh, actionless. It cannot produce anything. It is Asangam. It is not having any contact with anything, how it can produce. Pro production means vikara. Vikara, without vikara, it is, production is not possible. Brahman Shuddha Chaitanyam happens to be nirvikaram. Therefore, it is not possible. Tasmat mayot patti angi kare Shuddha Chaitanyam vikari bhavet. If you accept from Shuddha Jaitanyam, Maya is born, what will happen? Shuddha Jaitanyam becomes a Savikari. So you are changing the definition of the Shuddha Jaitanyam. Therefore, Kincha, Edi, Shuddha Jaitanyat Mayot Patti Ruchate. If further you want to argue, and from Shuddha Jaitanyam, Maya is born, still you want to vehemently argue that Uchate Tarhi, then Moksha Dashayam Shuddha Chaitanya, after getting Moksha also, Mukti Sthiti also, the Shuddha Chaitanyam Satvat Punaha Mayot Patti Prasangaham. After Moksha also, Shuddha Chaitanya will be there. From that Shuddha Chaitanya again Maya will born. Again Maya comes again, Nama, Rupa, Jagat comes, Samsara comes. That is the problem. Syat. That is why if uh, Moksha Dashayam also Maya will exist because Shuddha Chaitanya Chumma Irkadu create Pannu Maya. That is why if it really it creates. Therefore, moksha sadhana vaigyartham, then moksha sadhanas are useless. What is the use of doing sadhana for moksha? Enna moksha ananjana kapparam koda, after getting moksha again, eh, maya is going to born again from Shuddha Chaitanya. That maya is born means world is going to born. Once world comes again, I am in samsara. Therefore, ingappa mukte kadiyadu. So sadhanas I don't want to practice. And people may come to conclusion if Maya is born from Shuddha Chaitan. All this uh, moksha vayartham syad tasmat. Therefore, <laughs> therefore means wherefore, since these four possibilities are negated, what are those four possibilities? From world Maya cannot born, from Jiva Chaitanyam Maya cannot born. From Ishwara Chaitanyam, Maya cannot born. From Shuddha Chaitanyam, Maya cannot born. Jiva Chaitanyam, Ishwara Chaitanyam, Jiva Ishwara happens only after Maya's intervention. Jiva Ishwara word comes only for them. Maya is the cause. From uh, Karyam, Jiva, Karya Ishwara, Maya cannot born. Maya is the Upadana Karanam. How the Karanam can come from Karyam? Therefore, Shuddha Chaitanyam Nishkriyam Avikari. Sorry, okay. Therefore, Maya cannot be born. Tasmat. Mayot Pattihi Rahita. Maya Utpatti Rahita. Maya is birthless. Maya doesn't have any origination. Ataha Eva Cha. Therefore, only. Anadihi, it is beginningless. 
वाट एवर ईज बर्थलेस इज बिगिनिंग लेस इफ इट इज हैविंग बर्थ मीन्स इट हैज गॉट ए बिगिनिंग वाट एवर इज हैविंग बिगिनिंग विल हैव एन एंड नव अनदर प्रॉब्लम मे कम क्वेश्चन मे कम सो माया इज अनादि ही बिगिनिंग लेस दट मीन्स माया डजेंट एंड एट ऑल नो 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 सा च एका एव माया इज वन ओनली ज्ञान ज्ञानाश्यवा सा यूनीक पॉइंट माया इज बिगिनिंग लेस अनादि बर्थलेस अनादि मीन्स बर्थलेस वाट एवर ईज बर्थलेस मस्ट बी पर्मनेंट अकॉर्डिंग टू वेदांत नो 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 इन द केस ऑफ माया इट इज सांता इट विल एंड सांता मीन्स इट विल एंड माया विल एंड वेन ज्ञान नाश्या ज्ञान वेन इट कम्स ज्ञान द्वारा थ्रू ज्ञान वाट ज्ञान वाट ज्ञान मेक्स दि माया टू एंड माया नाशम दट माया विल एंड बै ज्ञान वाट ज्ञान एंड ऑफ माया मीन वाट फस्ट आफ आल माया इज देर फ्रम बिगिनिंग लेस टाइम बिगिनिंग लेस टाइम इट इज देर मीन इट इज अनादि मीन इट मस्ट बी एटर्नल हाउ इट कैन एंड क्वेश्चन शुड कम मै इन दाइंड इट इज बिगिनिंग लेस वाट एवर इज बिगिनिंग लेस इज एंड लेस because it doesn't have beginning but you are telling maya is having an end <coughs> here end means not going to uh, totally get destruction not total destruction maya end means uh, maya has got borrowed existence from chaitanyam Maya end is equal to Santa ha Maya is equal to what? Understanding this Maya is having borrowed existence from me the Chaitanyam Brahma. Maya it doesn't have Swatantra Satta. it cannot exist on its own maya cannot exist on its own independently maya has got borrowed existence this understanding alone is the end of maya this understanding alone is the end of maya not that maya next generation next srishti won't come if maya ends na not like that for that person maya ends he will become a senior student for a senior student maya ends means not for all agnyanis maya continues for them even for gnani also maya continues its function maya continues its srishti sthiti laya it uh, role its uh, uh, no, joint venture along with brahman it continues but for a gnani maya ends means maya is as good as not there dvaita problem also won't come another question also maya is anadi means dvaita will come dvaita means brahman is there advaitam brahma and uh, maya is there anadi it is always with brahman you are telling again dvaita problem comes unlike visishta dvaiti visishta dvaiti also accept maya because visishta dvaiti accept uh, veda indro maya bhi pururupayate in veda it is said mayantu prakritim vidhi mayinantu maheshwaram भगवान कृष्ण सेड इन स्मृति आल्सो भगवद गीता देर फोर विशिष्टाद्वैत आलो आलो एक्सेप्ट माया बट देर डेफिनेशन ऑफ माया ईज डिफरेंट वी डिफर फ्रॉम 
विशिष्टाद्वैत इन माया से डिस्क्रिप्शन व्हाट दे से माया इज रियल एज रियल एज ब्रह्मन पुरुषा दैट परमात्मा परमात्मा इज आल्सो रियल माया इज आल्सो एज रियल एज परमात्मा फॉर देम लाइक सांख्या पीपल वी डोंट एक्सेप्ट दैट Maya is uncountable. It has got borrowed existence. How can you count the reflected face? You cannot count. But they count. They count Swapna also. Swapna is real for them. That's why Maya is also real. Maya karyam jagat also real or real. Namakinna Vedantin ke advaitin ke na Maya appearance is there. its uh, ex- experienceability is true only na no? world its experienceability maya appearing in the form of world experienceability utility and transactability all are correct but maya doesn't have uh, reality it is less real than brahman you know all this because this is the context you have to remember therefore there is no problem for advaitam brahma advaita siddhanta ka no problem why advaitam brahman alone is paramarthika satyam maya is uncountable na gananiyam it is as good as non existent irindi pohatume na appearing let it appear that is my vibhuti na but it cannot touch me <laughs> like swapna cannot touch the waker and a problem hmm? another dream comes today every day dream comes no problem asangaha jagrat purushaha is asangaha from the swapna prapancha like that i the atma chaitanyam am nanta pragnam na bhais pragnam na bhayata pragnam nana vandi atma chaitanyam therefore next uh, this is first part of definition he is going to further explain first part of definition means what uh, we has we saw all the four parts in the uh, maya swarupam further he is going to elaborate what he says next paragraph i will read seyam maya sadasad vilakshana kriyam sorry ಕಾಲಾಧ್ಯಂ ಯತ್ ತತ್ ಸದಿತ್ಯುಚ್ಯತೆ ತ್ರಿಕಾಲಾಧ್ಯತ್ವೈತನ್ಯಮೇವ ಸತ್ ಮಾ ಜ್ಞಾನಬಾಧ್ಯತ್ವಿಲಕ್ಷಣ ಅಪ್ ಟು ಹಿಯರ್ ಐ ವಿಲ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಪ್ಲೈನ್ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ವೆರಿ ವೆರಿ ಇಂಟ್ರೆಸ್ಟಿಂಗ್ ಮೈ ಫೇವರೇಟ್ ಟಾಪಿಕ್ ಡಿಫಿನೇಷನ್ ಆಫ್ ಮಾಯಾ so eternally um maya is eternally available either in manifest form or unmanifest form now after giving the maya swarupam now he gives the nature of maya we saw now what is the nature two points he mentioned anadi maya is beginningless it cannot born from anything second definition maya has got an end two definitions over now this is uh, only nature okay maya's nature is anadi its nature and it is one eka and it is and uh, has got an end this is the swarupam of maya maya lakshanam okay now maya ಡೆಫಿನೇಷನ್ ಲಕ್ಷಣ ಮೀನ ಮಾಯಾ ಸ್ವರೂಪ ಮಾಯಾ ಲಕ್ಷಣ ಸ್ವರೂಪ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ನೇಚರ್ ಆಫ್ ಮಾಯಾ ಲಕ್ಷಣ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಡೆಫಿನೇಷನ್ ಆಫ್ ಮಾಯಾ ಕ್ಯಾರೆಕ್ಟರಿಸ್ಟಿಕ್ಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಮಾಯಾ ಸಾ ಇಯಂ ಮಾಯಾ ದಿಸ್ ಮಾಯಾ ಈಸ್ ಈಸ್ ಸದಸದ್ ವಿಲಕ್ಷಣ Maya is three lingam, therefore Sada Sad Vilakshana. What do you mean is Sada Sad Vilakshana? Sat means what? Asat means what? And Vilakshana means what? We saw this topic many times. 
uh, I will repeat again then you will understand difficult to remember that whatever I said previous classes in other texts also I said Sat Asat Sat 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 Asat and Sat Sat three are there Sat means uh, Paramarthika Satyam Asat means uh, uh, Tucham and uh, Sat Sat means uh, neither Sat nor Asat uh, different from both existent and non-existent you know when i read explain you will enjoy enjoy okay sadasad vilakshana maya is known as um, which is different from sat and asat then a student may think you know mandag adhikari no <laughs> doubt may come what do you mean by sat tell me Trikala abadhyam yatu sat tat sat iti ucchate. Note, this is the definition. You can write down in any uh, one uh, book you can maintain. Maintain means uh, important uh, uh, statements, definitions you can write in one notebook. It is very, very useful. I used to do like that only. So, what do you mean by sat? Sat is that which is unnegatable at three periods of time, three kala, past tense, present tense and future tense. Huh? I have to do action, past tense and yesterday, present tense now, future tense later, hmm? uh, tomorrow, three kala, abadhyam, unnegatable, whatever is there in all the three periods of time without uh, uh, negation that is called sat then what is asat trikala okay satyalanu is telling trikala abadhyatvat since it is unnegatable in three periods of time chaitanya meva sat what is that sat that which cannot be negated at three periods of time and only one thing in the universe that which cannot be negated by anything at any time by anything by anything at any time at any place what is that chaitanya meva sat that chaitanya alone is called sat what is that trikala badhyam which is called sat that is chaitanya that sat alone pure existence satyam jnanam anantam brahma that is called sat then whereas maya tu jnana badhyatvat whenever you get jnana you become a senior student <laughs> okay apdi sollikano jnana badhyatvat eppo jnanam varumo atma jnanam varumo maya tu whereas maya vailakshanya dyotanartham Sat is unnegatable, but Maya is Santaha, negatable. Jnana Badhyatvat, when Jnanam comes, it can be negated. Therefore, Sadvilakshana. It is Sadvilakshana. It is different from. Vilakshana means different from. What? Sat. Sat means what? Chaitanya. Therefore, Maya is different from Chaitanya. Chaitanya is called Sat. Maya is different from Sat. Correct? So, Sat is that which exists all the three periods of time. Beautiful definition. That is why he gives in bold letters. Sat Vilakshana Maya Jnana Badhyatvat Maya Sat Vilakshana Since it is negatable through knowledge what Maya. Maya is negatable because in the above sentence he said jnana nashyatvat santaha he said therefore it is negatable therefore it is uh, uh, not sat sat vilakshana this is first part of definition then you can say it is asat it is non-existent it is existent you cannot say because it is negatable chaitanyam alone is sat maya is uh, not sat 
then second part of definition is um, suppose any person can come okay okay you said maya is not sat do you mean it is asat it is asat it is non existent then he says kalatraye api apratiyamanam shashashrunga vandhyasuta akasha padmadikam asadityuchate ज्ञात पूर्व आया तत्म न प्रतीयते तथा ही जगत् काले सारी तथा ही जागृत काले अहम अहम न जानी अभूयते माया स्वप्नकाले प्रतीयम सर्व पदार्थ उपादान कारणतया माया एव विभाति सुप्तोत्थित सुखमहमस्वापम न किंचिदेदिशं परामर्शो स्मृति भवती सा चमृतिरुभूते अर्थे न संभव तस्मा सुषुप्त अज्ञाभव अस्ति अज्ञान माया इति एकमेव वस्तुच्यते इत्थं माया अवस्थात्रये अवस्थात्रे माया प्रतीयते इत्थं अवस्थात्रये अवस्थात्रे माया प्रतीयते अतः सा असद्विलक्षण so maya is not sat over then maya is not asat also you cannot say it is not there also not there like what na he says is a vague definition <laughs> asat padarthas are like this what are they na kalatraye api apratiyamanam in three periods periods of time that which does not exist is called asat okay it was not there it is not there it will not be there what number 1 sheshashrunga you know this all i explained already sheshash sheshashrunga means rabbit horn rabbit doesn't have horn in the past also have rabbit doesn't have horn horn means comb horn in the present also rabbit cannot have horn in future also that is trikala asatvam trikala apratiyamanam abadhyam nu solla koodadu abadhyam na irundha thane negate pandradukku pratiyamana apratiyamanam theriyave theriyadu kannukku yaradhu muyil kombu paathala na paakave illa enoda thatha kollu thatha paathara na na paakala Hmm? Are our grandchildren are going to see tomorrow? No, no. We will come. Yaro paaka muniya. Irinda thani paakar theke. Adinala tuche asat jannar. Tuche asat. So sishasringa. Then vandhya suta. A son of a born woman, a woman who cannot give birth to a child is called vandhya putra. Vandhya means a widow cannot give a birth to a child. vandhyaputra and a widow woman cannot give um, birth to a child like that asat vandhyaputra is asat there is a son of a widow varna widow var has got a son na poiya paadi mudiyadu tappu vandhyasuta vandhyaputra doesn't exist then aakasha padmam khaga pushpam khapushpam solvanga आकाश पुष्प कैन यू सी एनी फ्लवर इन द स्कई एनी टाइम एनी वन ऑफ यू हर सीन फ्लवर इन द स्कई इन पास्ट प्रेजेंट फ्यूचर नो फ्लवर इज अवेलेबल असद इतुच्छ दे आर ऑल कॉल्ड असत नॉट ओनली दीज एक्सापल फॉर द असत देर आर अनदर आलो ज्ञाना पूर्व बिफोर नॉलेज the cause of the world maya tat karyam na pratiyate gnanat purvam before knowledge maya 
एंड तत्कार्य जगत न प्रतीयते सो माया यू कैनॉट सी जगत यू कैनॉट सी ज्ञानात् पूर्व तथा ही जागृत काले सिमिलरली सिमिलरली न प्रतीयते मीन्स सत्वेन न प्रतीयते सत्वेन न प्रतीयते दिकॉज ऑफ द वर्ल्ड कॉज ऑफ द वर्ल्ड एज एक्जिस्टेंट एंटिटी यू कैन नॉट हैव एन एक्सपीरियंस न प्रतीयते डजेंट अपियर तथा ही सिमिलरली जागृत काले इन जागृत अवस्था जागृत अवस्था अब पद्मादिक आकाश पद्मादिक द कम इज बहुव्रीह अर्धे कफ प्रत्यय इन दैक्स्ट तथा ही जागृत काल इन द सेम वे जागृत टाइम आलसो वाट वी से अहम अग्न ई एम इग्नोरेन्ट पर्सन ब्रह्म न जाना ई डू नाट नो ब्रह्म माया तिरियाद ब्रह्मन तिरियाद न जाना अनुभूयते माया वाट इज माया न इन जागृत काल टाइम यू एक्सपीरियंस माया एपड़ना ब्रह्मन तेरियाद अदा माया इलिया एन माया कनदर नेम इज अज्ञान अज्ञान इज वाट ई डू नाट नो मई ब्रह्म नेचर अहम ब्रह्म न जाना अदा माया पाल्हार अभूयते माया अनृत मिथ्या माया अनिर्वचनीय अभूयते वाट अबउट स्वप्न काल स्वप्न काले प्रतीयम सर्व पदार्थ इन स्वप्न आलसो वाट आर आल आबजेक्ट वी आर् सीयिंग एक्सपीरियंसी प्रतीयम पदार्थ ड्रीम आबजेक्ट ड्रीम ड्रीमर ड्रीम आबजेक्ट आल ड्रीम एक्सपीरियंस अनुभव प्रतीयम सर्व पदार्थ उपादान कारणतया माया एव विभाति व्हाट इज उपादान कारण ऑफ मेटीरियल काज ऑफ मई ड्रीम माया माया एलोन इज द काज माया एव सो दट इज कॉल्ड ब्रह्म अज्ञान एलोन इज कॉल्ड माया एंगेंगे ब्रह्म अज्ञान अभी माया चलूंग माया अ स्वामी ने ब्रह्मन तेरियालो नी ब्रह्मन पुरीजो अभी माया अड़िया ना माया अना एनमो ना वेरे एंो इला माया ब्रह्मन तेरियामल माया अदार माया एव विभाति वाट अबउट इन स्ली जाग्रत आलसो ई डू नाट नो ब्रह्म ई एम ब्रह्म ई डू नाट नो अद मायाप वाट अबउट सुषुप्ति अंद ड्रीम आबजेक्ट ड्रीम एक्सपीरियंस यू आर् सीयिंग एंड अंद दे आल प्रोड्यूस मै वाट माया अद माया सुप्तोत्थित वेन स्लीपिंग फर् दैट पर्सन आफ्टर वेकिंग अप फ्रम द स्ली सुप्त उत्थित मीन वाट अ पर्सन हू हेज वोकन अप फ्रम हिस् स्ली सुखम अहमस्मासम ई स्लेप्ट वेल नुंग न किंचिद अवेदेश ई डू नाट नो एनीथिंग इन दई डि नाट एक्सपीरियंस एनीथिंग इन मई स्ली परामर्श हि रिमेबर्स इन ब्राकेट्स परामर्श मीन अर्थापत्ति प्रमाण स्मृति भवती दट ईज प्रत्यभिज्ञ रिमेबरी स्मृति भवती नाट प्रत्यभिज्ञ मेमरी हि रिमेबर्स रिकलेक्ट्स साच स्मृति अनुभूते अर्थे न संभवेत दट स्मृति रिमेबरिंग दट ई स्लेप्ट वेल ई डू नाट नो एनीथिंग इज नाट पासीबल इफ हि वुड हेव नाट एक्सपीरियंसड एनीथिंग सो हि वुड हि वुड हेव एक्सपीरियंसड समथिंग सुखम कारण वृत्ति इज देर 
Karana Vritti is nothing but Maya. That's why I slept well, I do not know anything. And told me, Adida Maya Pana. Sir, I learned Nadan Nirkad, Na Sambhavet. Ananubhute Arthe, Na Sambhavet. If you would have not experienced that, you could have not remembered that. What? Deep sleep, la, Yena Nadan Nadan. Tasmat Sushupta Agnana Anubhu Anubhava Hasti. Therefore, alark me two katran and a numetria than Sunday, Adida Maya Purier there. In the Mayan Jagratha Kalano, and a Brahmatria, the Aditria, the Tria, Adida Maya Sushupte, Sopna Kalano, then a dreamer, dream object, cell projection, Maya. In deep sleep, I don't know anything, I slept well in the numetria, Adida Maya Anubhava Hasti. Therefore, Agnanam Maya Yiticha Eka Meva Vastu Chate Agnanam alone is called Maya Yiti Eka Meva Vastu One alone, there is nothing else. Therefore, what? Yitam Avastha Trayepi Maya Prati In three Avasthas Maya is there. Therefore, you cannot say it is Asat like Seshashrunga. Like rabbit horn, you cannot say asat. Atahasa asat vilakshana. Therefore, it is different from asat. More. Oh, I have time. Okay. Asat vilakshana. What about sadasad vilakshana maya karyam? That we will see in the next class. Om Pur Namada Pur Namidam Pur Nath Pur Namudachate Pur Naske Pur Namadaya Pur Nameva Vasishate Om Shanti 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 Harihi Om Shri Guru Bhyo Namaha Harihi Om